Sandra, what are three ways in which social media can help me save money? Sandra, this is like a favorite question of mine because there are so many apps that can help us save money. Really? Uh, a few off the top of my head. Uh, Favado, that's F-A-V-A-D-O. That is an app that shows you all of the sales and unadvertised sales in your grocery stores. So you could go to the store, you know, on the corner. In your local store. Your local stores. You uh -huh. pull it up by zip code and you find out what your local stores are. You, it tells you all the unadvertised sales, um, deals, any coupon, you mm -hmm. know, things you can get for free. So that's a great one. Um, there's also one called Saving Star. You don't, the money doesn't come off of your um, bill at the register, but it gives you money back into a Savings Star account, which you can trade in for Amazon gift cards or oh, PayPal. Wow. Mm -hmm. And then there's a similar one called Ibotta which gives you money back as well. So let's say you go down to the store and buy a gallon of milk. You can get 50 cents back, let's say, um, with Ibotta if, if it's one of the deals in their app. Oh, I and you see. can just save it and you get your money back, not at the register, but like in a separate little savings account that you can do. So there's a lot of ways to save on social media. You know, following the pages on Facebook is huge because they have coupons and you know free items. Most of the K-Cups that I have are from Facebook giveaways. Um, from the companies directly. So those are some some really easy tips. How do you have time with four children to do all this? I do a lot. It just I've been doing this so long. It just comes second nature oh at this gosh. point. But it but it can it can be time consuming. Yeah. It's kind of like a treasure hunt. It is. <laughs> I like it. <laughs>